Welcome everyone. I'm in Old World, Wisconsin with my family. There's Austin and my sister Jess. Oh, hi. And there's Connor again. There's little guy. Hi. <laughs> they didn't have those in the 1800s. I just saw a dragonfly going straight on. Hi. I saw a dragonfly going straight on the car one time. Otherwise you come this way to oh. enter. Oh yeah, we're looking for admission. Dress like we're supposed to be. Yep, 18, uh, 1880s, 1890s. That's the one. The, you're from the future. <laughs> like some sort of weird sorcery. I felt like this is back then, right? <laughs> this place is set in like the 1800s, right? 1880s? Yeah. That's what I saw on the internet. I haven't, I haven't been here since I was a kid, 13 years old. I'm from the 1980s. You're from where's, the 1980s. Where's the town? Like the black Christmas. That way. I'm trying to... I was trying to dress like the 1890s, Bruce Campbell from Briscoe County Jr. That's what I was going for. I don't think the coat, I don't think the coat matches. He had a coat similar, yeah, the coat doesn't match. It's a bomber jacket from the 60s. Oh, right here. Still looks good. Still, yeah. All right. I want to go down my Let's go pay and pee. Pay and pee. Yeah. Okay, I got a pee. Right. Some awesome 1800s Porta Johns. <laughs> Look, Connor, they had computers in the 1800s. Paid for admission, I got a gold coin and everything, and I just dropped in the fucking ground. <laughs> a $5 gold coin. What can we get with this? All sorts of stuff. Yeah, you can get an old-timey soda, you can get an old-timey chalkboard, uh, maybe even candy. Except the old-timey soda alone probably cost $5. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> that, so. Oh, well. All right, now where's my map? You get the experience. The experience of having a $5 gold coin. And that souvenir cup. <laughs> Is this really from the 1800s? Is it really gold? Is it gold? I don't know. It looks like it. It's gold. I can break it. Is it chocolate? Bite it. You gonna ride that trike with me? Ride the, I wanna ride the trike. I wanna ride the actual like bicycle with the huge tire though. The actual bicycle. Yeah, but it's a didn't they say it's a tricycle? Do you race? Which means you, which means which means you can't fall off the thing. It's a tricycle. I want to actually take the danger and ride the the big tire bike. Yeah, the old timey bike. You know, ins insurance and stuff. They can't take the risk of people getting hurt. Oh, that's horse shit. I wouldn't sue them. My word's good. But you know, somebody else is gonna sue them. You? No. If I fall off, will you sue them? <laughs> um, are we going to tricycles? Yeah. Under the fence. And the stupid ass rain's coming in. It's authentic 1800s fountain and recycle bins. Man, they thought of everything back then. You could also take a shit in there if you wanted to. Doubles as an outhouse. Is that in there? Are the bi bicycles in here? All the bicycles are in there. Old timey bicycles. <laughs> Racing them is not ideal. Racing them is not ideal, Austin. We will ride some old timey bicycles. No racing. I gotta have my sister man the camera for me. <laughs> Well, we have a high wheel in there that you are able to sit on, but no, we don't have one for you to be able to ride around. Insurance doesn't cover that too much. So. Oh. <laughs> I want to ride the bike. I wish I could be the exception. I want to take that on. <laughs> <laughs> I've never sued anyone in my life, no matter how bad I got hurt. <laughs> I want to do <laughs> Hey, he's doing it. <laughs> I should take one of those out riding at 1 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Bring it. Load one of those up with me. Copy the release. Oh, gosh. Go back here. Let it get you. Okay, let me take a crack at that thing. Ha <laughs> ha
All right, honey, you're next. Oh, I want a picture on that one. I'm gonna climb up there. Did every one of these guys have to have something like this to get up on? Oh, no. No. <laughs> None of them would have that. You wow. actually can't mount it that way if you're planning on riding it. How would they get up on these things? You see this little step back here? <clears throat> That's how that. they did it, huh? Yeah, so you hold on to the handlebars, you get it going, you have your one foot up on that, you push off, and you use that to hop onto the oh, seat. Wow. So it needs to be in motion already as you're getting onto it. Oh, that's Just nice. like it can't completely stop as you're trying to dismount. Wow. I actually, I actually want one of these just to try it. Right? I've gotten hurt enough times, I can take it. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was too weak. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like I'm on the other bike. I can't get on that one. I can um it's hard to <laughs> You got stage fright right at the yeah, last second. That's about it. Stilt. Stilt. Oh man, I wanna use the stilt. See on this camera. Oh my god. Okay, so actually if you wrap your arms around them. Go get them. Yeah. Like this? Whoa. To the back. I that helps you be able to balance. I can't eat the I can't eat the I can't eat the <laughs> 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 oh, wow, were you watching? Yeah, I was. <laughs> we're just playing with the hoops. <laughs> now you gotta run the town on stilts. <laughs> or we can just all that way, dual on stilt. Yeah. Put in drunk this. We're going into the village over there. I see a house. I'm like Shyamalan the village. Oh. Uh, oh. That was terrible. Man, if the village is anything like that movie, this would give you a horrible experience. <laughs> what movie was it? The village. The village. By M Night Shyamalan. There's a tram coming. Shyamalan. It was dangerous in the 1850s or 1800s with all those trams. It looks like someone does live there. All the infants. Someone there. does live there. Someone's house is in the middle of old world Wisconsin. Wouldn't that be crazy? I gotta go to work every day and drive through all this pioneer bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> is it F-150 bus? Man, F-150s were pretty nice back in the 1800s. Oh, excuse you. It farted. <laughs> Trams farted back in the 1800s. That's how they released the exhaust. <laughs> they had nice lighting fixtures in the 1800s. Don't eat the paint. The paint was lit at that time. A lot of kids died. The, the lighting and the, the trams and stuff were nice. Hey, if they're eating paint, they deserve to die. <laughs> There's food on the table and it's full of flies. <laughs> flies like food in the 1800s. <laughs> <laughs> flies like food in the 1800s. I look pretty good. That'd be in too that old timey mirror. That old timey mirror. This must have been George Washington's house. He lived in Wisconsin in the 1800s. <laughs> This is better than the John Hustis house. I was kind of kind of glad my batteries ran out that day because there was really nothing special about this. Was it, is, was it like this? Similar, but this was like was way better. Yeah, I didn't get the freedom to just do what I wanted to. I ended up looking at my arms in the mirror for a while. <laughs> that was so bad. That's when I knew I was starting to become a douchebag. Did you Yeah, I stopped looking at my muscles. <laughs> Okay. 
Well, I hope she's making cheeseburgers. I know. That'd be awesome. Cheeseburgers are really good back in the 1800s. Yeah, cheeseburgers are great in the 1800s. Carrot and apple together. Dirt road. I feel like there's one way High noon. <laughs> Should have brought my Winchester along. Should have. <laughs> you want to see the blacksmith? Isn't that where they hang criminals? <laughs> yeah. That's a gallow? The black myth was shot in the back over a matter of $80 by Buford Tannen. Actually pull the steel up your piece right in the middle and we're going to push this side up into that corner and start in the middle and put this side up. Turn red, then orange, then yellow, then white. You can't touch this. Oh. You can't touch this. Here, metal. Uh, orange and yellow. Keep pushing that steel. See how much it moves. You can make it move a whole lot. Wow. I got my hand up. Let's see a real life blacksmith, and the blacksmith was Santa Claus. <laughs> Santa Claus existed in the 1800s, right? Yeah, he was a blacksmith back then. That was before he was Santa Claus. That guy's hair. That guy's hair was awesome. That guy's hair was awesome. We're gonna hang him high. Those prisoners are gonna be hung. Well hung. They're gonna be well hung. I guarantee it. You're staging a show where the prisoners are gonna get hung. Are you gonna hang prisoners? Alright, we'll go on the benches. Are you gonna hang prisoners? Taking off the coat. Where's your torso? <laughs> I got you. Did I get you first? Did I get you there? That's not my torso, it's my chest. Just... Anywhere. Anywhere. Anywhere in the chest. Chest oh, no, body. Alright, oh, no. ready? <clears throat> Honey, say go. 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 <laughs> oh. ah. I got your crotch. Anywhere in here. Oh, I won. Oh. <laughs> I thought you just took a shot of something. <laughs> I need a shot of whiskey before I go in here. The family did live upstairs above our heads here. Griffith Thomas lived there with his wife. Very stuff because women are making the majority of the clothing for family members in this time period. In fact, the counter there on the other side, that's called a notions counter because you might look in there it's kind of a neat little general store there wasn't anything in there I really wanted unless I wanted some dried peas or some shit it's a horse two horses hey guys what's up The old house. Oh, this is a bathroom. Yeah. There's no pier. I wonder if we'll find real life human feces in there from the 1800s. Hey, pee pee. Pee pee. Pee pee. Doesn't care. There's a sheep over there. All the, other animals, All the other animals are dead. <laughs> they all went to heaven? They died back in the 1800s. They had firewood back in the 1800s. How come, um, how come the doors are blocked? They don't want us in there. We're going to the next town over, huh? What is this town? What was this town? <laughs> Trams, those were the threat in the old days. <laughs> Trams killed a lot of people back in the 1800s. There weren't anything to screw around with back then. 
Why do you think people carried Winchesters and revolvers? Uh, this is um, the 1880s village, is what it's called. This one is? Yes. Stupid or rain, I got a speck on my animals. lens. Yeah, you do. Is the animals? Yeah, a speck on my Life animal. on the farm. It's in a German town? <laughs> yep, that's so, where we're going. We're here and we're going to go down this road here. Town. We're going to the, yeah, we're going to Germantown, the German area. <laughs> yep. We're going to the, hey, the Sanford and Son farm is that way, to the oh, left. Yeah, Sanford farm. Oh, yeah, Sanford farm. I'm coming to see you. I'm coming, Elizabeth. I'm coming, Elizabeth. <laughs> Can't we rent a horse to ride to the towns? <laughs> oh, that'd be so much fun. Wouldn't that be awesome to ride horses through here? Horseback riding is amazing. Big kettle pond. Oh, that's so awesome. They take people around in case you don't want to walk all that. How do you get over there? You gotta go around. Wow, look at that. There's a lot of high grass down there. You'd probably be walking right in the water in there. Yeah. That's what happened with me at Rock River filming stuff. Why would you want to go around? There's been so much rain, I was like, I was waist deep in water and it was all long grass and I didn't see it. The graveyard is up here? It's just like Castlevania. I'm all for graveyards and creepy scenery. That's legit, huh? In the woods to the other cemetery. Oh wow, that's cool. Cemetery. Is there really people buried here? Yeah. Tom Green was buried here. It's located on the far side of the Shotler home and it's surrounded by a horizontally open fence. Shatner home. The building in the very center of the compound here is the bakehouse or summer kitchen. And this small building out here next to the road is the smokehouse. The last two buildings here are the greenery and the piggery. Piggery? That's my favorite word, the, the piggery. 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 That's, That's where Curtis is. Yeah. <laughs> Another kind of a fence here to our left. This one is called the field hole. The tree is cut down, the bark peeled off, the small branch is cut, and it just stacks. Maybe. What village is this? Eagle. This is Eagle? Oh, you mean the village in... Old yeah. Um, I want to get up on you. Finish? Finish? Yes, the fins. Yeah. The fins. Yeah. <laughs> Stacked out. He's attacking you. Yeah. Knock it off. <laughs> you need to carry him. Yeah, how about you walk to the end of the fence? No. No. Every farm had a waterfall in back in the 1800s. The evil dead cabin. It, wasn't it looks similar. Polish. Polish area and German area. Oh, that's a half mile walk. Oh. Yeah, we want to go this way to the Danish area. You don't want to go for the half mile walk? Yeah, the kids will never make it. <laughs> We'll perish. We'll all perish out here. We'll be stuck out here still talking about Superman 4. I found some guests I got to take oh. back. Okay, do you want to so ride or do you want to wait till I come back? We can just ride with you. Yeah, I'll okay. take it. <laughs> sure. Well, everyone, that was Old World Wisconsin. There was still a lot more to see, but the kids were all tired out and we kind of let the day slip by us, right? We got a late start and we screwed around a lot in the first big village. We figured we got five hours to hang out to see stuff. The sea stuff. Yeah, and that Old time stuff. went by really fast. Stop, pack a couple 
really bitter beers and a buffalo cheeseburger and all that. Yeah. A good time. And a cheap, very expensive hamburger. <laughs> but thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed. I know there wasn't a whole lot, but you get the, you get witty banter from us, so. It's true. So. All right. Let's see y'all next time. Bye.